All day, money, power, respect, three the hard way. Back to three the hard way TV. We got the beautiful Brittany, Boo Watson. I'm Dion. On today's show, we got an email coming in. I'm going to try to go through it as quickly as possible. It's coming in from a, a, a gentleman. He says, uh, I love your channel. We appreciate that. I never imagined I'd be in this situation, but here I am. I've been one girlfriend for four years now. We have an amazing relationship. I have never suspected that she would be unfaithful because she has never given me a reason. She travels a lot for work, and she is sometimes gone for two to three weeks. On this last trip to Finland, she told me about an African guy she met and how nice he was. A booty she, scratching. <laughs> she told me they had a nice long conversation and that they exchanged numbers. She's very friendly with people, a.k.a. I ain't gonna say it. Um, so, <laughs> I didn't think much. I noticed after she got back that she kept ignoring calls, which she never does. I guess the guy kept calling her. Mm -hmm. So I got nosy. I checked her phone late night and saw the message she was exchanging with the guy. And one of the messages she told him she was leaving and she wanted to let him know before she left. He then responded saying he was very happy to have met her and he was glad they spent the night at least. Whoa. She responded saying thanks for dinner and a great conversation. After that there were a few good morning beautiful texts from him. Hey. But she didn't. Hey. Re <laughs> bro, I don't even want to talk about this, bro. You didn't <laughs> reciprocate the shit. Shut girl. Don't let him hear that here, Earl. <laughs> I confronted her about the text. She said they went to a cafe, had done a talk for about four hours. She went back to the hotel and he went back home around 11 p.m. She never lied to me, but the text was so blatantly <laughs> incriminating that <laughs> it's hard to believe her. What do you guys think? Did she sleep with him or should I believe what she said? She is not the kind of person that would sleep with someone hey. she barely knows, hey. or at hey. least that's what hey. I think. I, I would got, appreciate your input. Thanks, guys. I just got flagged. I just got flagged gratitude because because when he's speaking on y'all questions, that I don't let the shit play out until the uh, end of what been because I hear the shit before the fact. She, you share that girl, bro. <laughs> she cheated on. Man, you share that girl, bro. Three weeks? You share that girl. She's friendly. We up man. Every bitch that I can see up here and talk to and we up man, I can fuck. You hear me? So you share that girl, bro. I'm not finna even sit up here and play no more games on this show, bro. You share that girl. She cheated on him? She cheated she on him. She with the feeling to fuck the African if she ain't dude? Cheated, if she ain't cheated on him, bro, she, she, she misplayed your trust, bro. You don't want her fucking with nobody while she fucking with you. That's that's the that's a relationship. Yeah. You hear me? About her giving her, that nigga her number and who up man, that shit over with, bro. Yeah. Ain't no more playing, bro. You share that girl, bro. Ain't even no more playing on this show. You share that girl, bro. And now, now whoever else got something to say, they can say something about it. <laughs> this is cheap, Brittany. If she didn't, she got playing on to. She was gone for three weeks. It's changed numbers. She cheated then. Good morning, beautifuls. Long conversations. I was glad you came and kicked it with me and woo out the band. Bro, but she ain't supposed <laughs> to kick it with her, bro. You hear me? Fuck that bitch like Young Dro, bro. You hear me? That's what it is with me now. You hear me? That's what... Fuck that bitch. Hey, you know what? I... If, if as a man, if I got a number from a chick that I just met somewhere, I'm gonna be accused of cheating. Yeah, cause so I. So I'm not. I'm not gonna what do I want double this standard. For. You know what you want that number for? And, and if she has changed her number and was talking to a hmm. dude somewhere else, man, you can't trust that hoe, man. You sit up here and play all these games, grown folks. Go ahead. You slapping your hands and shit. Go ahead. Cause we sit up here and play all these games as grown folks and civilizations like we don't know the games of this shit. Oh, is she doing this and she doing that? You just said she gave a nigga her phone number. And was gone for three weeks. Gone for three weeks. Where he oh, was at? Oh, sir. 
Well, what the band, man? I just, uh, thank you for your conversation and this and that. Bro, that's it, bro. Yeah, man, that's all. And, yeah, and his text all said, th is the man thanks, thing, for, thanks for the night we spent together. Do that mean they spent the night together or they spent time together that night? Because I would be confused on that part. Because once I read that shit, I'd be like, this nigga fuck my bitch. <laughs> Possibility is endless with that. How should how should he read into that as a woman? You know what I'm saying? I mean, I, I, whatever stipulations come after this fact is it, it, pointless because first of all, why is it even a conversation with the perfect total stranger anyway? So from oh, that, wow. just, but no, even even the point to whereas that you you were comfortable enough to tell me, oh, like I met this African guy and we exchanged numbers for you to even be comfortable telling me that was already you didn't already cross the Red line, flag. period, right? So. It's like I'm finna tell you something, but I'm not finna tell you the whole truth, but I'm finna give you a motherfucking idea. Then like you said, the, the behavior change and you people don't necessarily know uh or notice that they even changing their motherfucking behavior when they in the shit, but other people that's look that know you or think that From they the know you they, they they gonna see like oh bitch you you always answering your motherfucking phone. I don't care if it's work, personal, business, whatever. And then all of a sudden you ignoring calls because in the back of her head, like, oh I know this motherfucker probably on this time over in this country. So this is the time he gonna be motherfucking calling me. So I can't answer because I'm with my man. So I mean everybody gonna pay attention to motherfucking detail, especially when it's some a foul play in the motherfucking game. So from her even entertaining it's, it's nothing wrong with high and bad, but when you entertaining somebody like, oh, he got my number, we can link up. Because can't okay, nothing sh nobody tell me from Africa that that I can't talk to with my motherfucking man about. So when she gave him her phone number, everything else, it was... It was right, if it, if it was a business or work related, there's no way she should be like, oh, take my number, that sort of thing. Like... Right, and I'm leaving. Right, like that's that's endearments that you give somebody that you fucking with. Cause only a motherfucker you fucking with gonna care that you gone or you made it in or you know I appreciate the fact. Like only a motherfucker who who you been endeared to would feel that way. So yeah, that that, that little time and space that she been getting, man. She probably nine times out of ten growing apart from you, or when she's somewhere else. As you say, she was gone for three weeks, man. She probably was looking for a little attention one night. Probably got a little tipsy. She probably say she was at the coffee shop, but she probably was at the bar. You know what I'm saying? And you to let her go on to get her Mandingo Warrior. <laughs> and he probably fucked the shit out your girl, man. I'm just being realistic, man. I'm not even going to say probably. She Booyaka. fucked him, bro. She fucked him. A booyaka. She, they did something, bro. They, they gave each other some head. So I, I'm just gonna say it, man. Something happened. Don't trust them. You know what I'm saying? Just come to a keep it real and say, look, man. Tell me. And if you man enough to take it and still want to be with her, more power to you. Yeah, beat that bitch. <laughs> No, you don't. We don't condone any of that shit. Yeah, catch that bitch, goddamn. You hear me, man? And that Africa, goddamn. <laughs> and the finger for a leg lock. You hear me? Man, don't play with the peoples, bro. I'm trying to tell you, man. Now just walk away, bro, if you get that serious. You feel like you gotta put your hands on her, you go ahead and scatter. Skedaddle, stage left, man. Be the bigger, be hoe, the bigger bro. person. They think you a hoe, bro. <laughs> That's what they think. Think he a, hoe, he a sucker. Well, that's what they thinking, bro. No, man, man don't Once do it, bro. Once you realize you ain't no hoe, bro, man, they gonna get it in. You gonna have a buddy in the head like an African head like he can't get out of here. <laughs> mama, bro. Hey, bitch, get up out what of here, What the bro. fuck is an African head lock, bro? Yeah, you ain't gonna get out of there. <laughs> Phone him. you ain't getting out of no African head lock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, my yeah. God. Hey, and she always travels to work. Do y'all think that she just randomly having one night stands and shit like that as she been care, traveling? Bro. I don't even care, bitch. Do what you gonna do, but like I'm trying to tell niggas these days, bro, it's a double standards with these women. They think we not supposed to do shit that they do. So, yeah, if motherfuckers need to really stop giving these bitches money for shit that they think is frivolous and whatever. I need my nails now. Well, bitch, you need a job. <laughs> 
Fuck out here. I'm about to do that, bitch. You ain't, you ain't been getting your nails done. Don't look for me to get them bitches done. Oh, my yeah, God. Man. That's what I'm trying to tell, <laughs> motherfuckers, man. It's a double standard out here, man. You, you, know, you, just, taking, see, you know, you taking, just you just moved up to the number one handed person on the show list. Man, I don't give a fuck, man. <laughs> the motherfucker that was the number one wouldn't talk about it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm going to get on their ass, you hear me? But like I said, bro, like, you got, you hear me? Like, stop. Can he mend this relationship? Can he, he can, can he, get... he can, but like, if he, if he, if he drop down to what she's on, and I'm going to give everybody a chance to talk. If he drops down to what she's <laughs> on, I feel like he's going to have to take a back seat to something. You hear me? That's what I feel like. I feel like he's going to take a back seat to something like he's not going to be able to do this the right way or the bitch going to be able to talk to him some type of way. So don't take a back seat to that shit and just treat bitches how you want to treat bitches. You hear me? <laughs> That's what I'm trying to tell you, Can bro. Can you mend this relationship, Brittany? Mm, not if she's going to keep that job. Not if she's going to keep the job? She just told her. Cause I, I wouldn't trust it. I mean, cause it sounds like she probably a stewardess or right. She's she wanna be a part of the like high that. club. And if this is what I mean, if you have to network or whatever, do with other people like this is this is your livelihood, this is your career, this is what you do, this is what you do. But you can't, we can't do this. We want to be long distance type of motherfucking relationship, and I will be selling my motherfucking self short, being being faithful to you, and you out here doing whatever the fuck you want to do, and vice versa. If he was a motherfucking stewardess, and you, she sitting that motherfucking or pilot, or whatever. Yeah, pilot or whatever, and you know what I'm saying, they eat. Oh, we we snowed in, we a motherfucking sweet, and I gotta be here for two weeks, and be, like you're gonna feel some type of way too. So I wouldn't even expect. I, well, I hope she would that not put those. Keep bracing. Right, and I would hope she would put those stipulations like, "Oh no, you know what I'm saying? You have to be with me." It's just, it's just a conversation that needs to get had, and I think you can find somebody who's going to be a little bit more grounded, literally, than you know, have to travel to work so much. She cheated on you, bro, but it's a possibility that you could, you could probably rebuild things with her. But oh, if, if, but if, the trust if, is if she goes somewhere like, for four hours, I'm thinking that bitch fucking or texting that nigga or me, calling him or something. Me being yeah. a nigga that's been in the streets all my life, homie, man, I don't think you could rekindle that shit. Once a bitch get a taste of <laughs> an outside dick, that outside dick keep them hoes sick. Like, ugh, I like it like that. She working that back. She don't know how to act. Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to tell you, I ain't even trying to be funny or nothing. He laughing and shit, bro. I'm trying to be funny. I knew where you was going yeah. when you started saying the song. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. I like it like that. <laughs> I'm not trying to rekindle it, get you off your bitch and none of those shit like that, bro. But, like, shit, man. Like, shit, once they stray towards a certain way, bro, like, man, you can't get this. So, we, we, no we, them back. we all unanimously. Agree that she cheated on. What Jay Z on. said, nah, nah, we ain't been cool like it since the last show or so. But what Jay Z said on that song, man, what what's what's a good girl? What's, what's a, a good girl gone bad? What's a good girl gone, gone bad? What's a good girl gone bad? She gone forever, man. You hear me? Like she is. She was probably a good girl when you first met her, but after the fact, you know what I'm saying? She did that shit, bro. Like don't, 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 don't downplay yourself. Right. And then, I mean. She did it for her own motherfucking selfish reason, so I think that you should make right. it your mistake. next move. Just I'm, just I'm just playing. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. Fuck one of our friends now. Friends ain't even fucking with it. <laughs> yeah. Fuck one of our friends now. Friends ain't even fucking with it. Yeah, man. I'm fucking with you. Yeah, man. Bitch, I'll whoop you. <laughs> Yeah, fuck one of my friends. Now friends ain't even fucking with. He done been juvenile, that little way. Okay. He been Jay Z. Well, if she ain't been like that, she ain't gonna tell you, sorry. Like, like, she ain't gonna tell. She ain't gonna tell him sorry. Man, look, cause I, I be all types. I be, question, I be thinking all types of shit. Every time I get in that pussy, after that. I'm being that motherfucker like, nah, this pussy don't feel right Thanks now. Thanks for the question, bro. What, Three the hard be, way TV, you man. You gonna be like what? <laughs> Dion, like Brittany. He's up at the, that altar. Chief Keith. <laughs> yeah, yeah, all of that. Just having flashbacks of Tanees hitting his wife. Exactly. 
I can, you can't even marry her, bro. She's un, unmarriageable. You got your fans. <laughs> I just made up a word. She's unmarriageable. You feel me? Cut your losses, man. Go on, get the fuck up out of there, man. Yeah, man. If you want to do this, if you want to keep hitting that pussy like from time to time, man, just to build up your status and what, man, like I'm fucking this bitch and what, but keep doing that, man. But don't make that bitch your main bitch, bro, because. No, yeah, no. I don't see no. I don't see no. I don't see nothing positive. You, you better be careful. You know, no, I'm saying I don't see nothing positive coming. You yeah, know what I'm saying as far as what man, just keep fucking and like have a other main bitch. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. don't 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 wipe her, bro. Now just get rid of all completely, man. Get up totally out of your system and uh, move on. Start fresh, my man. You know what I'm saying? That was my next question. Since we all agree unanimously, should he just go ahead and break up with him? Yeah, definitely. Break up with I her. mean, she broke up with him before he even knew the relationship was over. Yeah. She should come clean too and admit, and then admit what, to what Then what, what you going to notice, bro? The Mandingo or whatever you from, man. Mm -hmm. or, he ain't even going to be there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And she going to wish he had you, bro. And my mama, It'll bro. That's what I tell else. you, bro. So just leave that shit alone, man. The bitch going to come back. Ooh, I bam, six times strong. We're talking about some... Oh man, oh man, when I was with you, man, you used to remember when you bought me that. Yeah, I remember that, but uh, bitch, you ain't got to worry about that no more. <laughs> yeah, because you fucked that up, fucking with goddamn uh, Sayel. <laughs> you fucked that up, fucking with Sayel. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, Ariel Cole, 9999 That's the African, uh, <laughs> that's the African goddamn. Uh, yeah, that's the African. Uh, nah, 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 that's the motherfucking Six, six, six. Three, 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 three. Oh my God! Hey, On that note, <laughs> y'all got any questions for us? Leave them. <laughs> Leave them in the email or the phone number that's below, man. <laughs> Leave those comments below. <laughs> Thank y'all for watching. Subscribe. Give this video a thumbs up. Brittany Boo Watson up there. Thank y'all for watching. <laughs> 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 I'm fucking with them African booty stuff. All day. Money, power, respect. Three the hard way. Boy, real here from Three the Hard Way TV. Go like our fan page on Facebook. Also subscribe to the YouTube. Don't forget to like and share this video. Comment under the link. It's your boy, Real. Shout out to all our fans that love Thank us. We coming. love you too. And Shout all out to my motherfucking love haters. Hey, I love you motherfuckers, okay? And I know y'all see the ladies looking good in them 3 to Highway TV hey, shirts. Three, <laughs> the Highway T. <laughs> Y'all hit that subscribe button for y'all chance to win official three to hallway TV. Yeah, I don't know if y'all gonna be able to make those shirts look as good as the ladies got them looking. Oh, <laughs>